Q-cells, REC, or Maxion. Who has the most efficient solar panel as we're going into 2024? I'm going to be answering that question and teaching you all about solar panel module efficiency in today's video. Hi everyone, Joe Ordia here for Solar Surge, and for the past 12 years I've been helping families achieve energy independence using clean renewable energy. Now, if you're new to the Solar Surge channel, on Solar Surge you're going to find product reviews and comparisons on solar panels, batteries, inverters, EV chargers, pretty much any technology or component that makes up a home renewable energy system. Now, we also do short educational videos like today's video here, where I'm going to be showing you the top three most efficient solar panels for your home as we're going into 2024. Now, when we talk about module efficiency, module efficiency simply means of the sunlight that is applied or that hits the, the surface of the solar module, what percentage of that sunlight or that irradiance is successfully captured and converted into usable electricity. Right? Not all of the light that hits the, the surface of a solar panel is actually converted. In fact, a good amount of it is just reflected right back away. Some of it passes straight through the module, and then some of it gets lost as heat in the conversion process. So typically, only about 22% of the sunlight that hits the surface of the solar module is successfully converted to electricity. And as of this recording, right now I'm in December of 2023, Anything over a 22% or so module efficiency is considered a high efficiency module. Now, in today's lineup, I'm gonna be showing you the top three residential solar panels in terms of module efficiency as we're going into 2024. And with that, let's get to number three. All right, coming in at number three on the list is the Maxion 3 420 watt all black solar panel. Uh, and as you can see on the data sheet here, offers module efficiency up to 22.2%. Now, just a year ago, Maxion would have been much, much higher on the list. In fact, if you know the history of this product, um, the SunPower Maxion panel, it used to be that SunPower and Maxion were the same company, uh, and they had the most efficient solar cells uh, on the market. Uh, some of the technology that they have was all the way back paid for by NASA uh, for development for use on uh, the space shuttles and the space stations. And so Maxion, by far, for the longest time, had what was considered the most efficient solar cells in the industry. Uh, unfortunately, the, the company ran into some financial trouble and they ended up having to do a restructuring where they essentially split off the solar panel manufacturing and the solar cell manufacturing business from the actual solar sales and installation business. And so SunPower today is really just a, a solar sales and installation company whereas Maxion is the company that still does the manufacturing of the solar cells and the solar modules. However, the competition has caught up, and where Maxion is only offering 22.2% with its 2023 model solar panel, I'm gonna show you two other brands that are offering higher module efficiency and at a significantly lower price per watt. Um, but based on its, its pedigree and its history, Maxion, I believe, deserves to be on this top three most efficient solar panels lineup and it ranks third in this year's lineup as we're going into, about to go into 2024. All right, coming in at number two on the list is the Qcells Qtron G2 430 watt solar panel. Now, the Qtron panel offers up to 22.4% module efficiency. So that's 0.2% higher than the Maxion panel that we just looked at a moment ago. But the thing with Qcells is, is Qcells is the number one largest US solar panel manufacturer. Uh, just in terms of raw volume, both on the residential side and on the commercial side, Qcells is number one in terms of production value. Uh, in fact, we had a chance to visit their production facility just outside of Atlanta, Georgia, where their current plant is able to put out up to 10,000, actually I believe 12,000 solar panels per day when running at max capacity. Uh, and because of those economies of scale, Qcells is able to offer the Qtron product at typically a much, much more competitive price point than the Maxion panel that we just looked at a moment ago. And that's another reason why Maxion was ranked lower than it had in previous years. So because the Qcells product, I an anticipate this is going to be probably the most popular solar panel installed in the US in 2024, 
And because again, they have that large scale production capacity, I think you're gonna find that the Q-Cells offers a high efficiency panel, but at a very, very competitive price point. So if you're looking at a good high efficiency made in USA product, I don't think you can go wrong with Q-Cells. For what it's worth, this is the brand solar panel that I installed on my house when I did my full home system back in 2018. Now, of course, I can't give specific pricing. I know many of you would like us to be able to give specific pricing on these videos, but in most cases, the way this will work is uh, your, your local solar contractor, your local installer will be able to buy these panels from a wholesale distributor, and then uh, the wholesale distributor will negotiate pricing with the contractor. But really what you wanna look at is overall, what's the price per watt or what's the price per kilowatt hour uh, produced in the first year of the system to help you get a good apples to apples comparison between different options. Uh, and by the way, folks, if you're a homeowner out there, if you're looking at different solar power options for your home, uh, if you need to get a price quote using one of these panels or with any of the other top brand of panels, as always, you can feel free to reach out to us on the link below there, set up a call with one of our solar experts, and we'd be happy to get some pricing and some information to you. So anyway, Qcell's Qtron G2 430 watt panel, number two in this year's lineup of most efficient solar panels. And coming in at number one is the new REC Alpha Pure RX 470 watt all black panel. Uh, as you can see here on the data sheet, the Pure RX 470 reaches module efficiency of up to 22.6%, um, and it does it in that all black uh, aesthetic that most homeowners prefer right now. Um, the REC panel, although it is considered kind of a super premium panel in terms of performance, typically the price premium that you're gonna pay over a more high production panel like the Q-Cells, it's not that much of a price premium. You, you might see 10 cents a watt to 25 cents a watt price premium, but overall I think it's a very competitively priced product considering what you're getting in terms of the performance. Now, of course, there's a couple of other things that set REC apart from mainstream panels when you're talking about a premium offering. Um, the next differentiator, of course, is the 25-year ProTrust warranty. And so, although pretty much all Tier 1 solar panels offer a 25-year warranty, uh, REC's warranty covers the electrical performance of the solar panel, the mechanical integrity of the solar panel, and the labor or the service. Uh, and so what that means is that if for some reason one of your solar panels is underperforming and the contractor that did the original installation is not able to come out and make repairs for whatever reason, REC will at their own expense pay to have another contractor come out to replace the defective panel for you. So by offering that 25 year protection on parts performance and labor, gives REC one of the strongest warranties in the industry. Now, the other two factors that set REC apart are the lower degradation rate and the lower temperature coefficient. Now, when we talk about degradation rate, what we mean is each year, solar panels lose a small percentage of their, their production as the solar panels age. And so a standard solar panel is gonna lose about half a percent of its production per year. However, the REC Pure RX only loses a quarter of a percent of its production per year. And so that means that even in year 25, which is the terminal year of the warranty, these panels are still guaranteed to produce at least 92% of initial rated power. So what that means is you're gonna have more total energy harvested over the lifetime of the system. And then finally, the REC panels offer the lowest temperature coefficient for a residential module at only 0.24% per degree Celsius above the ideal temperature. Now, when we talk about temperature coefficient, all solar panels will lose uh, a bit of their performance when they have to operate in extreme high temperatures. And so very simply, the lower the temperature coefficient, the lower the performance loss is as that temperature increases. So the lower this number, the better the solar module is gonna hold up under extreme high heat conditions. So if you're watching this, if you're in an extreme high heat environment, like let's say Phoenix or Las Vegas, uh, or even parts of Texas, where you're gonna have rooftop temperatures in excess of 140, 150 degrees, looking for a solar panel that's not only efficient, but that also has good high heat and a, and a good low temperature coefficient, uh, can provide more overall lifetime value for you uh, during the lifetime of the system. Well, folks, that pretty much does it for today's video. Again, this is a wrap up of the top three most efficient solar panels as we're going into 2024. 
Uh, of course, if you're getting good value from the videos that you see here on Solar Surge, make sure you give us a thumbs up uh, and go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well if you haven't done so already. That way, as we have new videos like these coming out, it'll come up on your homepage and you can stay up to date with us. Uh, again, of course, if you're in the process of getting solar power quotes for your home, if you already have quotes, maybe you just need to get a comparison quote to make sure that you're getting the best deal. Uh, as always, you can reach out to us on that link below there, set up a call with one of our solar experts, and we'd be happy to get some pricing and some information for you. Well, I thank you all for spending some more time with Solar Surge today. As always, I'm Joe Ordia here, encouraging you to get prepared and be empowered. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon. All right. I hope you're getting some great value from today's video content. Now, if you would like to have your product or your business or technology featured on the Solar Surge channel, feel free to reach out to us at the link below so you can set up a call with our media team to talk about your marketing goals and how Solar Surge can help you get there. Solar Surge is the leading online community in the U.S. residential solar and energy storage space. And so if you'd like to get your product, business, or technology in front of our audience, we can help you do that. Uh, again, feel free to reach out to our media team at the link below or email media at solarsurge.net.